we're here on the National Mall for the March for Science. This is the ABCs of celebrating science. We're here to advocate, we're here to demonstrate that science benefits everybody, but we're also here to celebrate science. teach in tents where we have scientists talking about their different areas of expertise. The conclusion here was that that loss of contact with a diverse natural world can actually make us sick. This is conservation agriculture folks, as good as it gets. What gives me most hope is the collaborative stuff going on. We have hundreds of collaborative endeavors. You just need to dive a little deeper beyond the Washington headlines. That gives me hope. I think this event is important because as scientists we need to be able to speak to broader audiences beyond just our peers and to why science is important and why it's valuable. I work as a scientist every day for the Nature Conservancy alongside 400 other scientists who believe that the best way to save nature is through science. <laughs> It's just amazing to get together with people and celebrate the fact that good decisions are only possible with good information. If we don't stand up for science, nature loses, and so do we. So as a scientist and as a mother, I ask you to use your voice for science. Call your representatives. Call them again and again, and when you get really frustrated, call them again. In the words of the great scientist Jane Goodall, never give up. Yeah.